Welcome back to Milwaukee Studios and today we're going to be talking about how you guys can move, scale, and rotate your text inside of all of 0.2. So let's get into it. First thing you need is you're going to open up the actual project and make sure you have your video tracker or whatever. And now we're going to add the text by pressing the plus button, go to title, click and drag it on the video track. Now all we need to do is make sure we have the pointer enabled select the text. Now that we have that, we actually need to do a right hand click, go down to the add, go to math, then hit the math one, hover over that line, it should turn blue, left click and it should add in between. Now we're going to select that and instead of this footage one, we're going to go into this panel and we're going to change the math to multiply. Now that we have that, we only need to add one more node so we can start editing it. So go add, and then we're going to go down to generator orthographic matrix, select that. Now all you have to do is hold down the control button, left click, drag to the math node, and then go down to value two. Now that you have that, you should have it hooked up. So I'm going to change my text real quick. So we're going to call this um, cool, whatever. And we're going to change the font probably to Arial black and sizing of it a little bit larger. And now that we have that, we can change the position by selecting on the orthographic matrix node. And all we have to do is move the position and it's going to move it with it. X and Y position. You can do that. You can even do the animation with the stopwatch on the right hand side of it. And you can even do your rotation like that. Last thing we have is our scale. You either can do a uniform scale, which is going to do the X and Y axis scale together, or you can unselect the uniform scale and now you can change those parameters separately. So we now have a 157% scale on the Y axis and 102% scale on the X axis. But I'm going to hit that just in case and we're going to change this to 100. And you can even change the anchor point, but this is all based off of the center of the frame. So for instance, if you already had an animation with your position, rotation and all that, if you wanted to change the animation just to be like slightly over to the left or right, you can do that here by literally just doing that. And if you guys see that little bit of a circle with like a line through it, basically that is your anchor point that you can visibly see and you're changing the position of the box which is actually related to the text because the multiply node is combining them to make sure that they're equal to the same thing and it's altering the text node. With that said, we have a playlist over here with all of my Olive tutorials if you guys want that and we even have a video over here that YouTube recommends for you. So I'll see you guys all later. Keep creating.